guys, welcome back to Mark's Failure. Make sure to like, share, subscribe if you want to, but if you did, we'd really appreciate that. Sorry about all the background noise, but that's okay, I'll try and um, talk louder. Um, but anyway, so today is another episode of my how-to series. Um, and today, if you can't tell by what I have out, I'm going to be telling you how to make some two delicious smoothies. And if you want another one of these, like your subscribe. Really easy. And then probably make a part two. So, first things first, I'm going to take the top off. Um, so, I'll tell you the two smoothies. One is a peach vanilla smoothie. And one is a banana strawberry smoothie. So, first, I'm going to do the easier one, which is the and the strawberry smoothie. For this, you will need a cup, a banana, and a strawberry yogurt. You can also just make it, um, you can also make it banana vanilla if you just want to use vanilla yogurt, but this vanilla yogurt is going to be used in the peach smoothie. So, let's get started. Okay, so first things first, you will need a banana. And then you don't need to cut it, but I just put it on the cutting board. Um, so I'm just going to throw the scraps away so that it's not as messy. All right, so now you can either cut it into small slices or you could just rip it apart like pieces like this size. Not that big, not that small. Like it doesn't really matter. Just want to pop those in the blender. And then you want to open your strawberry yogurt and also pop that into a blender. Anyways, after that you can just blend it up or you can um, add a piece of ice and blend it up. Alrighty, so now I only need like a little bit more but yeah. Okay, so now I'm going to take your cup, open up the blender, and pour it in. What I like to do is this is when I use my spoon and I scrape it off the sides because otherwise it um you waste a lot of it because you 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 really can get a lot of um smoothie off the sides to put it in the bottom and I don't like to waste. Yeah. Okay so um now you want to your first smoothie and this is what it looks like up close on the camera it kind of looks gray but really it's like this pinkish color um so it tastes really good and yeah just taste can sit um and also you can add two yogurts to make it larger but soon i'm making another one and i'm the only one who eats smoothies in my house um, I'm going to eat the whole thing, so I'm not doing double, so. So good. And these are also pretty, these are also really healthy and really delicious, so. These are also a good breakfast. They're really filling and delicious. I know I'm saying they're delicious a lot, but really, if you try it out, they are. Oh, okay. Now, off to wash the blend. All right, so for the next smoothie and the last one, you will need a blender, of course, a spoon, a cup, a peach, vanilla yogurt, or whatever yogurt you want. And same with the other one, like you can use whatever you, you want, but this is how you make it, like the way that I'm making it. Um, and the first step is to cut the peach. So what I do is I just cut slices and then you have to peel the skin off because obviously a peach skin would not 
have good texture for a smoothie. Um, so you just like want to just cut all the skin off and then, yeah, and then you can just cut, like dice the peaches, which means like cut them into small little squares. Um, the pieces, like I'll show you how big the pieces will, should be, but this step takes a little bit, so I will see you when I'm done. Okay, so I'm done cutting all my peaches and I put two of them in the blender and basically I'm going to show you um, how small the pieces should be now. Um, so basically I just like cut across like um, three or four times and then I just cut in the next ones. So I'll show you um, again and I'll show you these ones up close. Like about, sorry so when I'm stick together like about this size. Um, but only put two pieces, like two pieces in the blender right now if you want to do it the exact same way that I do it. So again, you cut it two or three, three or four times and then cut it in half the other way. And then, so after you cut, after you cut all of them and you put two of them in the blender, like two of the pieces that you cut up in the blender, then you want to open up your yogurt and pour that in. The order does not matter, but um, this is just the way that I like it, so I'm telling you the way that I do it. So. I really honestly don't know why I do it like this, but I do. So, that's all. Um, then, after I put the yogurt in, I put the other pieces in. And then again, you can put a piece of ice in, I don't. And then you just blend it up. I take my spoon, but well, open it up, and I take my spoon, and I just mix it up and put all the, I see if there's some piece, like some pieces that are still not blended up, and I push them all together into the middle, like a like that, and then I start it again. together so I washed it anyways and now I have to wash it again but that's okay anyways thank you guys so much for watching make sure to like share subscribe if you want to but if you did we'd really appreciate that and we want to thank everyone who has like subscribed and watched all the videos and stuff so I really hope you enjoyed this and maybe you'll try it out too and you can also experiment with your own smoothies like I normally just put some fruit in and then yogurt, maybe a piece of ice, then just blend it up and then you've got your smoothie. So anyways, let me, before I end this video, let me taste it. Mmm. So good. It's so different from the other one. So, that's all. Thank you for watching again. Make sure to like, share, subscribe. And yeah. Peace out.